Well, hello everyone, how you doing? You see what my wife doing? She getting her exercise. It's 1.45 a.m. Thursday, Friday morning. And she and we in the gym doing our thing. Yeah. And as you can see, the gym is totally empty. It was one gentleman in here, but he had enough, so he left. All right, so we're going to watch my wife do a couple exercises. You know, I'm pushing her tonight. We ain't even playing with it. She says she want to be me so young, me so thin, then this is what you got to do to come get it. We ain't playing with it. Oh, so y'all know that there's somebody behind the camera. It's standing up. Stanley. All right, push it, pull it, baby. Push it. Slower. Come on, push it. Push it. Push it like you mean it. For those of you that's home that's sitting down doing nothing, listen, let my wife be your sense of motivation and inspiration. Because if she can do it, ain't nowhere in the world that you can't do it. So let's go ahead on and make it do what it's supposed to do. Let's be elevated and energetic at the same time. Come on, push it. I'm, I'm, I'm going to see what she's going to do. I'm going to let her go through a series of exercises and I'm going to let her surprise you. Because she's definitely going to surprise me. Because I'm not going to say, baby, do this, baby, do that. She, I'm going to see if she learned anything. Okay. And then take you all through the motion. We did this today. I'll show it to them. All right, we following her. And this exercise works on what? For my arms. Okay, for your arms. Okay, let's go. Good form. Good form. Girl, I'm starting to see some muscles back there, too. Man, that's what you call consistency and dedication and commitment. Push it. Push it. I'm like a mar martinet in the military. I'm a drill sergeant. But it's all in love. Isn't that right, baby? Yes. Push it. Right now, it's not my husband. My, he's not my husband. That's right. Not her husband. I'm, 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 I'm her trainer. trainer. When we leave up out of side this building, then we'll start by being husband and wife. But right now, push. Take your time. Feel every rep. Good. You pulling that too easy, baby. Don't you think you need to put a little bit more weight on there? Okay, let's go. Pull it. Pull it. I don't know about you all, but we love making these videos because we love inspiring somebody. We love elevating the spirits of somebody that's saying that they can't, and we're trying to show them that they can. There's no such thing as C-A-N apostrophe T. It's I can, I will, I shall, I must. All right, what we can do in here, baby? We're going to do some lats. Okay, so we're going to work up under the underarm, the bra area. All righty then. Let's go. Let's make it happen. Good. Down and up. Good job. Good job. Good. Good. You looking good. I'm proud of you. 20 is the count. Make it burn. If it don't burn, it ain't saying nothing. If it burn, you saying something. Talk to me. Talk to me. Yes, you can. Push it then. Pull it. Pull it. That's what I'm talking about. Work them back muscles. Work it. Work it. That's right. That's right. My island lady. That's right. Talk to us. Come on. This is just like being in your own mansion. We up on the ground in our own gym. That's right. That's right. What, what you got? What you got? That's what I'm talking about. Good job. Good. What we doing here? Bend over for our back. Okay, good. Slow it down some. We ain't in no hurry. Slow it down some. Good. Good. We ain't worrying about the quantity. We worrying about the quality of the workout. That's right. Good job. Good job. Good job. I'm proud of you. Uh-oh, we still working on that back, huh? All right, come on, give me something. Give me something, I'm proud of you. Yes, indeed, she's saying something. For those of you, again, that's just joining us, listen, this is my beautiful, awesome, and amazing wife, but right now she's my cadet in the military, and I'm being strict as the Martinez are. Get it! Because I know she can do it. One of the most phenomenal, most amazing, home care practitioners there is. But this is how she continue to keep her clients happy. She come in here and take care of herself. And when she come in here and take care of herself, it's relatively simple for her to take care of her clients. Isn't that right? Yes. That's what I'm talking about. Stay focused. 
Stay, stay focused. Let's go. Stay focused. Push it. I want it to burn. Give me 15. How many is that? Let's go. 14. Let's go. Let's go. You owe me three more. Come on. Give me three more. Make it burn. Good job. Come on. Give me two more. You got this. You got this. Let's go. Push. One more. One more. Good job. Good job. All right. Let's work on. Let's do some therapy on that knee. Let's do some therapy on that knee. That's right. That's right. Come on. Let's build this knee up. We ain't got to go to the doctor. This is a therapeutic exercise right here. This is the arena. Take your time. Good job. Nice and slow. Good. There you go. That's how you build that cartilage up around that knee. Yeah, I need this one because this is... Push it. Push it. Push it. Push it. Push it. Down and up. Down and up. Down and up. Make it work. How many was that? Ten. You owe me twenty. You don't. You doing it with both legs. All right. I told you. We ain't playing today. We we in here to get it. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. That's what I'm talking about. Push it like you mean it. Push it like you mean it. Come on, prettier than me. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Good job. All right, let's go to the blue horse. Let's go to the blue horse. Come on. Let's go. Hustle, hustle. You told me that you want it. You're doing a live video for, oh. for, the, for the American people and for the Filipino people. So let them see how energetic you are. If you sloth, they going to sloth. You energetic, they going to be energetic. I want 50. Push it like you mean it. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 10, 12, 13. 14, 15, 16, 17, slow it down, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, you got this, 27, 28, 29, 30, let's go, rest for 10 seconds, 1, 2, 3, 4, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's go. Give me ten. Thirty-one. Thirty-two. Kick them legs out there. Thirty-three. Thirty-four. Slow. Thirty-five. Don't swing. Thirty-six. Thirty-seven. Thirty-eight. Thirty-nine. Rest for a minute. That's forty. One, two, three. Thumbs up. Four, five, six. <laughs> Seven, eight, nine, ten. Give me last ten. Come on, let's go. Last ten. Let's go. Just for you guys. Forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, fifty. Good job. Walk down there and walk back. Take a breather. Good job. Excellent. Excellent. That's what I like to see. That's what I like to see. You say you want it. I'm here to push it. Come on back. We're gonna do a, we're gonna do twist with the medicine ball. Get that medicine ball. We're gonna twist it up a little bit. You got this. You got this. Squat, open your legs a little bit and just twist side to side. Twist it up. I don't want your knees moving. Bend that squat a little bit more. Good. Come on, twist it out. You're doing excellent. Push it. Push it. Push it. Good job. Good job. 
Push it. Push it. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Give me bicycles on this horse again. You riding the bike. Ride the bike. Give me 25. I want your knees high as they can go. Come on, push it. You got this. Push it. Push it. Push it. Push it. That's what I'm talking about. 50. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. Let's go. Give me something. Surprise me. Excuse me. Come on, let's go. Let's work these shoulders. Unravel it. Unravel it. Unravel it. Let's go. You got this. Look at how the rope is wrapped up and just pull it out. That's all you have to do. You got this. If you do them both at the same time, it'll, it'll make a whole lot of sense. You got it. Come on. Pull it. Pull it like you mean. There you go. There you go. There you go. All right. Give me what you got. There you go. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seven, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, two, three. 4, 25, 26, 7, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 3, 34, 35, 36, 7, 38, 39, last 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 50, good job, good job, good job, walk it off, walk it off, just drop it, drop the rope, walk it off, walk it off, walk it off. Walk it off. Help me out. Help me out. All right, there you go. Where's she going? Where's she going? Where's she going? I think sometimes my wife be driving drunk. Come on, push it. Push it. Push it. Push it. Other side. You're doing excellent. You're doing awesome. I'm so proud of you. This is the hardest work in show business. I'm going to see if she can talk to you all because this is her last exercise. It's two o'clock, so we've been in here for an hour and a half. I think if, if we haven't gotten it in an hour and a half, we won't get it. This is it. It's so amazing, isn't it? I'm here, still here, healthy, full of energy, and I did it. And I did it. And magandang kumag John sa Pilipinas. And this is another day, night of the Filipina lady here. Yes, I'm still catching my breath, but I'm okay. And then it's good to be sweat, it's good to be healthy. And you know, this one thing that I shared to you this morning on my other video, that is the way that I really appreciate my partner. He always be there for me. He really pushes me every single minute that we're doing our workout. Have a wonderful, wonderful evening, early morning here in Las Vegas. Early morning, morning there in the Philippines. Love you all, God bless. So, I just want you all to know, just listening to my voice, I do it this way. See, the ultimate element of surprise is that of the unknown. The unknown is you never know who or what is going to push you or motivate you, but you have to have the burning desire to want to do it. And if you want to do it, then it happens. Hold this for me. I just want to share with you all 
the, the, the purpose of pushing this phenomenal woman. Number one, she was told when she was in the Philippines before she even came to the United States that she would always be a healthy big woman. She would always be in constant pain. She would always have to take pain medication. She would always have to get pain injections. But she found out different. Now, it doesn't matter that she ran into a foreigner because she could have been with a Filipino man, a white man. It doesn't matter what the man, what matters is the discipline inside the man that be able to push and encourage the instillment of motivation inside the woman. So God allowed our path to connect. So now that I'm here, it's my responsibility to push my wife with everything inside me. I push myself, so I have to in turn push her. I'm strict, I'm hard on her when it comes to in here. But outside of here, I love her, I kiss on her, you know, I massage her and all that good stuff. But inside this arena, I push her like I'm a martinet in the military because if I baby her, if I pacify her in here, she's not gonna get in the top of shape that she need to be in and you know what she'll say? Like you ladies often say, baby, you didn't push me hard enough today. So instead of her giving an, giving the opportunity to say that, I'm gonna push her hard so when we get in the car and we go to the house, baby, that was a good one. Baby, you pushed me so hard. Why? Because I appreciate her, I value my wife, and I love my wife, and I want my wife to be in the top shape of her life. She's come a long ways from when she first came here to Las Vegas, Nevada, and what month was that, baby? It's May. 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 Mm -hmm. May. Now, here we are in August, and she's dropped, what, 20-something pounds? Mm-hmm, something and like that. And that is incredible. And she has quite a few more pounds to go, but you know what? We have quite a few more pounds to go because it's the team that make the dream work. There is nowhere in the world I tell my wife, oh, you know what? Baby, you big. Why don't you go work out? Why would I disparage her sense of esteem and intelligence and lower her morale? If, and if anything, baby, you know what? Let's go work out together. Let's go do it. When she got off work today after working eight, nine hours, she said, you know what, baby? I want to go to the gym. Let's go. So we drove 30 minutes from Green Valley, I mean, uh, and yeah, Henderson, Nevada, to Las Vegas, to Anytime Fitness, and here we are, and worked out for an hour and a half, 25 minutes on the treadmill, and the remaining of the time, right here, working out in this arena. So I said that to say this to each and every one of you that have significant others. Love yourself first, and when you love yourself, you can love your significant other because you said that she's meaningful to you. You said she's purposeful for you. Not only just cooking, not only just washing, not only just taking care of the kids, but loving her. And why she loving herself, you love on her as well. And vice versa, because it's the team that made the dream work. With that being said, I'm gonna give my wife the last words, but it's definitely been a plausible pleasure to have had this moment to share with you all. And always know this, the ultimate element of surprise is the unknown. God bless. Yes, uh, here I am. Yes, here. He's my pusher man, my husband. He never stopped pushing me. I met him. I'm really a big lady. Until now, still here for me. And I really appreciate him. There's, there is guys, though. Everybody that out there, the wife is the girlfriend. You know what? Don't stop. Love yourself first before ready to love other, your, your boyfriend, your husband, whatever relationship you have right now. Okay, have a wonderful, wonderful early morning here in Las Vegas. And maganda umaga dyan sa Pilipinas. Ito na naman ang Pilipina island lady, a Pilipina uh, island lady here in the U.S. Have a wonderful night. God bless. Love you all.